A but caterpillar I'm, silenced a tomato's cry for health. Help. Help. Not health, but maybe. I don't health. know. Help. Same thing. Help and health. A cry for help. It might seen be a cry for help. Room. While there's a famous horror movie spoof about a killer tomato, no one seems to have made one about caterpillars. The insect pests that eat the juicy red fruits of summer. Uh, then it goes on for like a long time. It's a massive article. I was Holy wondering when you were going to tap out. smokes. Holy smokes. I think... I think this only got in there because the study took place at Penn State and we're with Pennsylvania's number one son. Holy shit. Uh, if the people that I know from Pennsylvania heard you call me that, because I've done a lot of shit talking. Oh. But I think I'm rebranding. You're re- <laughs> oh, yeah. 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 Pennsylvania David. <laughs> Rebrand made. There was a time when. Big baby Penn. But now. I'm going to read only the quotes from this article and see if we can make out anything. Okay. I'm not going to read any of the substance because it's like all yeah. sciencey and long. <laughs> not science people, huh? No. Uh, this quote says, um, this is incredibly cool, he said. I'm definitely going to teach this. So that's something. Can you split that? Yeah. Man. Okay. Uh, it's a very successful caterpillar, he said. Silencing the alarm. He's the brains behind it. I give him all the credit for pulling this together. So we figured it out, right? You ever collect caterpillars? Ooh. Caterpillars are really interesting when you're a little kid. I mean, I definitely, in my neighborhood when I was, I mean, I moved away from that town when I was eight, so I had to be like six or seven because it's in my memory bank. We collected cat Like those really fuzzy ones that are on the sidewalk oh, or yeah. spring. Like we went around, had a box full of those fuzzy fuckers. What are they thinking when that happens? They've just been got. Party? No. Nightmare. Caterpillar party? Um, how nuts is that, man? Caterpillars turn into butterflies? Butterflies turn into? Fertilizer. I thought birds. <laughs> <laughs> I get that. I can see why you'd think <laughs> Uh, yeah, no, caterpillars are wild. When you're a little kid and you don't, like, don't care about any germs or anything, like, caterpillars are like... I wish I had internet. What are those roly caterpillars, fuzzy caterpillars called? Caterpillars make you feel, like, more powerful than ants do. Do you know what I'm saying? Maybe. Give me one more sentence. I think you can get me there. Or you can lose me completely. BBD? So... Catching up, I had to answer <laughs> yeah. a Sources. sales message. Sure. Um, Flex. So you said caterpillars make you feel more powerful than ants do. Yes. Okay. I agree. Okay. I need one more sentence. You're either going to get me or you're going to lose me. Sometimes the ant wins. You can. <laughs> yeah. That's that's the succinct way of what I was going to say. Caterpillar doesn't get away if you, you don't can, want it to. Also, if you you're like, if someone's like, you got a caterpillar on your easy. arm, someone goes, you got a caterpillar on your arm. I don't think you're like doing that. I think you're like looking. Yeah, and you're like, you might. Ah, uh, you might I do. I think you you at first you don't go like a full freak out, but you can, if you can I jump, had yeah. one of the woolly bear caterpillars, which I think is what you were looking yeah, for yeah. before, yeah, I think I'd freak out. Normal caterpillar, I'm fine. No, what it is the person that sees you isn't even worried about you. They'd mm-hmm. be like, oh, you got a caterpillar. You got a there. caterpillar on your arm. Yeah. If it's a spider, it's, you got a spider on your arm. Yeah. They probably don't even get that out. They make a little scream first. They notice a spider. Sometimes when you're letting someone know, you give a little like, "Don't freak out." But with the caterpillar, you don't even. I don't it. think no. you. I don't think you give the caveat. Yeah, they don't bite. I think some caterpillars bite. I think some caterpillars can kill you. Don't tell me that. No, but like the I fuzzy like ones. Anything. Don't ruin. You know what's funny? Like I wouldn't me. touch a woolly bear caterpillar today. As right. An adult. I wouldn't even come close. I would do a normal caterpillar. We're like the picking those line. off the sidewalks. Oh, yeah. Eating them, doing whatever. Do you think you've eaten a caterpillar? On purpose, no. Do you think you've accidentally eaten a caterpillar? Also, no. Okay. Baby? I don't think so. Okay. I don't Make? think they move. I mean, yours is a yes. 
It's probably a Last guess. week you told us about you eating a bunch of goldfish. Like, I don't remember. <laughs> if you told me it's like the spiders and you have like, f- and apparently you like. Five, Caterpillars not five sneaking into your mouth. Caterpillars like I don't sleep. think sneak. Imagine that. I think they're big enough that you I notice. don't think I have. Awesome. I think I would have remembered that one. That's badass of you. I think if you if it happened, get, so a, get a text in five minutes. <laughs> you ate a lot of caterpillars. <laughs> I get the sense that like if it happened in your sleep, you'd like wake up. No one slept, ate a caterpillar. Yeah, if people say people say you eat however many spiders in your sleep right. a year. Spiders they sneak, can move, and they can be quick. pretty small. <laughs> okay. No one's sleep eating caterpillars. I don't think. So. I want that myth busted. Oh man, in our college house, uh, Pope House. Didn't one of the bedrooms was one of the bedrooms was the front <laughs> one of the bedrooms was the front porch that they like bricked up and turned into a bedroom and one of our roommates slept there mm-hmm. and what are centipedes what are those things that run across the walls that are just like fucking huge oh yeah those are gross yeah i think you got it no it's not a, is it a centipede millipede millipede maybe one maybe. of the peds yeah, they come out it's at one night. of the long, the like kind of long guys that are they, they're a little long. fat, and super they got long, all the and their legs. legs go like yeah, like big. They're big, a lot of legs. They just like climb on the wall. Should I call them? In the middle of the workday, text them. Who is it? Evan. Yeah, I think you can call him. Give him a shout. He's not gonna fucking answer. The Sorbos. All right. <laughs> <laughs> this is a guy I haven't talked to in so long. <laughs> I used to send him a, a text every Tuesday that just said, Evan loves the boobies. <laughs> <laughs> Were they silverfish? Could have been. Might have been. Hey, do you remember those those caterpillar, those bugs that ran across your wall in college? Yeah, house centipedes. House centipedes. We're doing the radio show right now, and I was talking about that and how scary it was for you. So yeah, it was, ter- it was terrifying. Sorry, that's my that's my dog. <laughs> oh, nice. It literally, it was literally the worst. Day, uh, <laughs> <laughs> it was hell on earth. Like, yeah. it was huge bugs running across the wall while you slept. Yeah, a thousand little legs. You, you'd put your laundry in the room, and then you'd come back to fold it, and all of a sudden there'd be, like, little house centipedes coming out of it, a thousand legs, and they move so damn quickly that they're there, and then they're gone. <laughs> so you, you know it's there, but you can never kill them. It's literally hell on earth. <laughs> okay, good, good. We're, we're just trying to remember that. Yeah. Wait, do, do remember when I texted you? Them? Remember when I texted you every Tuesday that you love the boobs? Yeah, I still have, uh, you, you type, you, you used a typewriter to write me a letter that just said, uh, it was about Stoddard, and it was like, hey, Evan, you got to be careful with this guy. He loves the boobies. <laughs> it's true. It's true. Yeah, yeah, some interesting times between the house centipedes and how much I love the boobies. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Do, do, does he think that uh, uh, any of those centipedes might have gotten consumed? Oh, do you think him? you ever ate one of the centipedes by accident? That was a question we had. I, I like to pretend it didn't. Happen, <laughs> it's a happier life there. Yeah, if I'm being honest, there's a there. I I give it fifty fifty, but you're not good odds. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right, <laughs> thanks, man. Thanks for answering. Hey, anytime. See ya. Anytime, buddy. Hope See you're ya. well. Bye. Bye. <laughs> That was hilarious. It was perfect. <laughs> I just remember him saying, like, the house centipedes, like, they're like a figment of your imagination, how fast they run. You're like, oh, shit, is that a giant spider that just ran across my room? Or did I make that up? <laughs> it's so funny that I think we've all had situations where you tell yourself in your head it was 50 50. <laughs> Put it out. <laughs> I tell myself it's 50 50. <laughs> Not good odds. Fifty fifty odds, not good. <laughs> when yeah. it comes to eating bugs, yeah. Ugh. Oh, that's great. Good hearing from Evan. That was. I was happy His answer. voice sounded like Did, a, little a little manlier. Yeah, deeper. Nice. Um, man. Okay, so that's the cat. That that's caterpillar news story. That's the news.